All right, this video is to show you an easier way to get to your turn signal flasher and change it. In, in this vehicle, I've looked around and you literally, some people are taking these apart, taking the other side of the dash apart, taking the whole cluster apart. I mean, it's just, it's, it's a lot of work that doesn't need to be. Plus in my vehicle, I have my CB and my trailer brake controller and stuff in the way and I don't, I don't feel like messing with it. So I'm, I'm going to show you an easier way to get to this thing. And, uh, you know, it, it's not going to take long. Now I've gone to the other side of the vehicle. Uh, it's just gives me room to do what I got to do. And, uh, I'm, I'm six foot two and I'm not, I'm not a small guy climbing around the inside of this vehicle. You know, it's a nice big vehicle, but here basically if you understand it, it's, it's actually really simple to get to this thing. Basically all you're going to do, and, and I, I did this beforehand just to make sure I could get into it and I'll explain it. But what you want to do is push your tab down, pull your ashtray out, put it aside, grab yourself a seven millimeter here. I'm just going to use this take out the screws seven millimeter four screws that's it take four screws out now that you got those four screws out what I'm going to recommend here is get yourself some tape Okay, or long sleeve, and the reason being is, and I'll show you this edge right here. This uh, plastic is pretty darn sharp right here. Okay, it's not so bad on the other side, but you don't have to worry about the other side. It's this spot right there. So, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get myself a piece of tape. just to protect myself on this edge. All right, so now it's not so sharp. And uh, I'll show you in the video in the end when I'm done. So the reason I did this is this edge is so sharp and I got a, uh, a long sleeve shirt on here because I when I tried this the first time, just to make sure I could reach the flasher, it scraped the crap out of my arm. So here I'm gonna show you protect yourself. And what you're gonna wanna do is go in and straight over, basically in and over. You're sticking your arm, you're sticking your arm right through here, straight across to get to that box right there. My phone wants to focus on my finger, but that box right there. Can't get it to, uh, right there. That box has tabs on both sides. So you're just literally sticking your arm straight across that box right there. Okay. Plenty of room. You look around in here to get your arm right over to that box. The, the, the four way flasher or the flasher is over here. It's, it's up under the panel, but it's over here. It's only, you know, an arm's reach over. So, basically, you want to just stick your arm in. I'm, I'm not even to the middle of my forearm. My arm's in. The cover is off. Okay. There's, a, there's like one or two wires from the ashtray there. But literally, back over. Give it a little tug. Four way flasher. It's out. Now, remember the position you take it out. Take your new flasher. New flasher. LED, LED uh, compatible for me. And you see the position of it. So it's going back in in that position. 
So. You want to feel for where you were. Using my thumb to push it back on. My cap goes back on the same way I took it out. Now, the fun here is, once you get your four-way flasher back in with your finger, is you got to squeeze those tabs on the black cover just enough to get it hooked back over so it stays in place. So, that's it. My tabs are hooked. The cover's on. The flasher's in. I put my... Peel off my tape. My four screws back in. Change the direction of my little handy dandy. Trays back in, and the job is done. Okay, like I said, I was uh, gonna explain real quick why I put tape on there and why I'm wearing long sleeves. This is what my arm looks like. It's it's not it's not bad. It just scraped me, and you know, there's no point in getting injured or cut. I'm sure if I went up or down, I probably would have been worse off. You know, it's very minor, but still, that's uh. Put tape on there to protect yourself or wear a long sleeve. I still, even with a long sleeve, you might slide your sleeve up and get cut anyway or, or scraped by it. Put put tape on there. Um, so from beginning to end, from the time I pulled the ashtray, pulling the cover, pulling the relay out, put a new relay in it, uh, the LED compatible relay back in, putting the cover back on and making sure, sure that she squeeze, squeeze the, um, the tabs to get the cover snapped back on and putting the screws back, put, put the screws back in and the ashtray back in. It was like five minutes or less. I think it was more like four minutes total I have in changing the flashers. So if this video made it any easier to get to your turn signal flasher in your vehicle um, and it helped you out, like, share, and subscribe because you never know what I'm going to do next.